hello friends welcome to my channel this is Charan in this video I will show you how to auto refresh dynamical data in a table using jQuery in PHP I'm reloading the page after 10 seconds I want to display this data here see here we got the EMP table is displayed after 10 seconds. Let's check the. Let's close this window. Let's edit the EMP name Mohit. Edit from Mohit to Mohit Kumar. Right now, this data contains Mohit only. So before click the go button. Let's refresh this browser. I'm clicking go. After 10 seconds, I want to get. See here we got the Mohit Kumar. Let's change to Mohit Kumar to Mohit. Notice I'm not refreshing the browser. If I click go, go see here we got Mohit again if you are a first time visitor to my channel please subscribe to get the latest updates just for the time saving, I have already binded the EMP table from MySQL PHP My Admin database into this PHP code. Let's check the output of this PHP code. And this is the output of the PHP code, which contains right now five rows in this EMP table. Now, my aim is I want to reload this automatically the data for a certain period of time. So, let's write the coding part. I'm adding a new page. In this new page, I'm adding the simple HTML code. I'm closing the HTML tag. Header section. Body. Close the body. Center tag. Center tag h1 how to refresh the dynamic data automatically php using jquery horizontal line now after the horizontal line I'm adding a do tag the do ID is auto data now let's save this file I'm saving this file in the root folder www auto refresh dot htm I'm saving as a HTML file. Save the file. Now, before loading this auto refresh dynamic data dot PHP file into this auto refresh dot HTML page, let's check the basic output on the browser. And this is the output of that auto refresh dot HTML code, which contains right now only header tags. Now let's call this php page into this html file. In the header section, dollar document dot ready function Oh, we have to add the script tag here. Yeah? 
script let's close the script now inside this ready function set interval function now inside this function I'm adding dollar between double quotes ID of the div hash dot I'm loading the data between double quotes this page name semicolon refresh method the last one I'm adding the duration period I'm adding 10 seconds that's it we have done the complete coding part but to run this application properly on the browser you need to add the latest jQuery Cilean snippet latest jQuery CDN Google I'm selecting hosted libraries and the Google hosted libraries notice at the corner there is a contents panel I'm selecting the jQuery here you can find the different versions of snippet I'm selecting the latest version 3.3.1 let's copy this one add in our HTML header tag let's save this file that's it we have done the complete coding part let's check the results on the browser go to refresh.html page now after 10 seconds I want to display the data this data here I'm reloading the page after 10 seconds I want to display this data here see here we got the EMP table is displayed after 10 seconds let's check the let's close this window let's edit the EMP name Mohit edit from Mohit to Mohit Kumar right now this data contains Mohit only so before click the go button let's refresh this browser I'm clicking go after 10 seconds I want to get see here we got the Mohit Kumar let's change to Mohit Kumar to Mohit notice I'm not refreshing the browser if I click go go see here we got Mohit again that's it